Hey guys, PSP Mav here and in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to make custom boot screen for your PS Vita. Now before we begin this guide, I just wanted to put out this disclaimer that this plugin isn't perfect by any means so in cases where it's not properly used it could lead to your PS Vita boot looping or even crashing on boot. So in such cases you can bypass the plugin by pressing the L trigger and the power button at the same time while turning on your PS Vita. And now that's out of the way we can start by going into Vita shell and then connecting the PS Vita to a PC using the USB mode. So once you're on your PC, open up your browser and then go to the link which are pinned down in the comment section. And add the Vita Bootamin file to your downloads and while that's downloading you can go and search for the GIF which you want to use as your new boot screen. So right now I'm looking for a Windows XP boot of GIF. For that go into the image section, click on more and then choose GIF from the type section. So this GIF right here is 640 by 480 which is less than ideal for our use case. Okay so this one is actually better because it's 1080p and we can lower the resolution in post. So once they are both downloaded, go to your downloads folder and here you need to extract the Vita Butamine RAW file. Next copy the boot animation GIF to the Vita Butamine folder and inside the folder you will see an application called Image Magic which you need to install on your PC. And while installing the application, make sure to enable install legacy utilities. Alright, so once the installation is complete, you need to run command prompt. And here you need to find the location for the Vita Butamin folder which you can do by clicking on this box right here and then copying the address. Next open up the command prompt and type in cd space then paste the location of the address which you copied earlier then press enter and now you need to type in mkanim space hyphen help and this should show all the commands which you can use for converting the GIF into the suitable format for the boot up. And here you can change the height, the width, add priority, compression and even enable cache. So since our boot up GIF is in 1080p, we need to downscale it to 544p and for that we can start by typing in mkanim space hyphen wood space and 60 then space hyphen height space 544. You can pretty much add anything you need you can even add looping or compression or priority so i'm just going to go with cache underscore fp and then wipe cache i 
and once you're done press enter and it should start converting the gif to a boot.rcf format and this should take a few seconds and once you're done it should say all done and then you can exit out of the command prompt next copy the boot.rcf file which you just converted to the root of your ps vita and copy the vbanim.vpk file to the root of your ps vita once that's done you can go back to your ps vita So once you're back, go to the UXL directory on your PS Vita and then install the vbanim.vpk file. Once the installation is complete, you should now see a new icon saying VBAnim installer. So run the installer and then choose the option install with a boot admin. Once that's installed, you should now see that your Vita is rebooting with a new boot up screen which looks something like this. Now if you go into the settings and then to the themes and background section you should now see a new option called boot animation where you can enable the plugin, enable loop and all the other stuff but for now I'm just going to leave everything as it is. Next you need to go back to your beta shell. Go to the UXO folder and scroll down to find the boot.rcf file. Now copy this file and then go into the URL directory and then to the type folder where you're going to paste this file. So once you have pasted this file, you can exit out of beta shell and then restart your Vita. And that's it. You should now be seeing your new boot up screen on your Vita. Okay, so I think mine was a bit too short. So when you are choosing your GIF, ideal. And that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching and make sure to subscribe for more awesome PSP and PS Vita content.